We paint a picture. Each color, our emotions, each line and curve, our thoughts. Now we don't necessarily know what it is we're making at first, but we do know how we view ourselves. The image we see when we look in the mirror usually is some sort of monster or thing. A creature we don't love with a face so full of imperfections we wonder how on earth we could even be living beings. We see the curves of our own bodies as betrayal, many of our physical traits, flaws. Each freckle may be a failure in our own eyes, even our own eye color shows how useless we feel, how empty inside we are. Now the picture we paint is in our minds. It's an image of who we want to be, what we want to look like. But our society has grown and evolved to have certain traits, certain characteristics that were acceptable to live with. And this image we paint is something we're forced to do because of our society rounding us into a corner. We're forced to see anything that could be considered an imperfection. Weight above the average curves that might not seem so flattering to others and so much more. We're forced to have this image of a perfect person. And the sad thing is, none of us are perfect. None of us can be in our own eyes, but yeah, we all force each other to act like we are. We paint a picture, showing a false identity, a distraction for ourselves to mask what our bodies are actually trying to tell us. We conform to society so easily that within so few years, we transform from a child who loves his or herself to a teenager or adult who can't be good enough for the rest of society. We leave ourselves out in the open, naked bearing our souls, sacrificing our own happiness to reach this goal of perfection. This perfection we can't have, this perfection no one has. We paint a picture. Each color our self-hatred, jealousy, and pain. Each line our self-doubts, insecurities, and feelings of uselessness. We paint this picture with the lines and colors so perfect, for they have become all we have known, all we have left of us, but it isn't who we should be. Our society paints pictures, hiding the people who lie beneath them. What society doesn't understand is the collection of colors. The slight traces of yellow from the few moments we manage to tune out the negative voices around us. The gray from the numbness we feel too often. The red of our pain from all types of abuse we face. The purple from the bruises left on our spirits, on our bodies. The blue from the cold of isolation every time somebody leaves us. The black of self-loathing. Society doesn't understand how every time it throws another requirement at us, it gives us another streak of the paintbrush on the canvas of our lives. We use the colors, though, to our advantage. We can take the brokenness we experience and turn it into something beautiful. Every line of pain is transformed into artwork. Every experience contributes to who we are, for we are a masterpiece made to be unique.